Hello everyone, welcome to my let's play of RimWorld. Uh, today we're gonna play Naked Brutality. I really like this mode. I played Crash Landed. Uh, I didn't try, I think, I don't remember trying Lost Tribe. I just remember they didn't have tech and you have to research a lot. And, and I think I might have tried Rich Explorer. But, uh,. I found Naked Brutality is my favorite. I, I really like it because you're forced to use a lot of stuff that if you play like Crash Landed or Rich Explorer you just don't get to use like a, a, a fireplace or you know or, or campfire or stuff like that that I just never thought to use. I'm, just, I'm like just build a heater or just build that you know stove. Well you can't do that not when you have nothing when you're butt naked so we're gonna play rough and we're gonna play classic class uh, Cassandra classic uh, I heard Vivi Chillax is easier at the beginning but towards the end it's about the same uh, and uh, I'm not prepared to play Randy random because Rim World's hard enough a game as it is uh, even on medium like recently like I think a week or two ago I played Three games, three times in a row, where I played uh, Naked Brutality, and I I I end up uh, having my guy die because of a disease like uh, like malaria, plague, or uh, an infection, and either I didn't have medicine or my character didn't have uh, good enough uh, medical skills or. And certainly, it's really tough because when you're, you only have one character, he has to get up out of bed even if he's injured or if he's sick. He still has to go out there to gather food and cook it and if, if he wants to eat because there's nobody else to take care of him. So, we're going to play rough and we're going to play commitment mode because, um, not because I w won't save scum. I, I can't guarantee I will not save scum. This, and if we save scum, this will be the first time I've uh, put a video on YouTube uh, playing a game where I uh, I save scum. Uh, but um, this go game's pretty hard. I I do save scum, scum even in commitment mode. And the way I do it is I before something happens, or if something happens that was really bad, I just Control Alt Delete and then I I reload from from there, or else I also I also save the game and put it on my desktop, put the save on my desktop, and then uh, you know if if something's gonna happen, like if I'm going to send the caravan out, you know I might do that because when my caravan's out there, you know I might get attacked and my base could get wiped or something. So. Uh, that kind of thing, that kind of saves scum. And the way, the reason why I do that is because if I do it reload anytime, uh, I have a tendency to save a lot. So I end up with like 20, 50, 100 saves, and then I forget to delete them. I, I don't care about them, and then they just clutter up my, uh, you know, my saves. And then, like, especially in with a game like Shogun 2, like, I play Shogun 2 uh, Total War, and all of a sudden I have like 200 saves or whatever and it takes forever just to load the saves right and so I don't like that so that's why I use uh, commitment mode here I'm using commitment mode here uh, so next we're gonna see in nerds okay we go with 100% and this is one of the things I like about this game or I don't like about this game is at this part of the game is uh, the load time is really really long but uh, overall, the load times for this game load from save or load from uh, the start of the game. Uh, RimWorld is actually pretty good, especially compared to something like Shogun 2, uh, Total War, or uh, right now the newer uh, Warhammer 2 that I've been playing. Oh my god, the load times. It just takes forever to load the game or lo to load a save. Um, RimWorld, that's not that big of an issue. Um, this is the only time, and if you want, don't want this 
long load time, you can just say, oh, let's do 30% of the world. We just load 30% of the world. So first of all, this is what I like to look for is, I like, like to look for a place where there's not a whole lot of these pirates uh, and uh, with a lot of friendlies. And I also like, like to look for um, temperate forests. Temperate forests where it's not a year round so uh, terrain. So where it's not year round with rainfall of over 1000 millimeter, probably more like 1500 millimeter. Year, uh, and uh, and it's not year round because uh, you get year round what you end up with is uh, you get a lot of boom rats and stuff like that it's it's uh, the game's way of punishing you for having access to uh, you know growing season year round and uh, you're also less likely to get mufflows which which is uh, in my opinion the best uh, animal you can uh, how should I say tame and that's ma animal you can have um, and I can go in that later so I, I usually like to go for large hills with marble being the number one stone type and granite being the second uh, type with most uh, stones uh, the reason why is because marble gives you a bonus to beauty so if you make a marble statue it has more beauty than if you make a granite statue and also with walls house when you build a house or uh, the wall and you use marble walls it apparently uh, gives uh, pro provide more beauty and that makes your uh, colonists happier so this looks pretty good except I don't like that rainfall and I like a lot of rainfall partly because of the fire now um, every now and then they'll have like dry thunderstorm or some kind of flash fire and uh, sometimes it's really hard to put out and uh, and then if you have a place that has a high rainfall it sort of takes care of itself eventually and or sometimes you just don't even have to worry about it just ignore it and, uh, and the fire will be put out by the rain naturally so I like the growing periods of 40 to 50 days I, 30 days is just too short that's too rough I, I don't think I can handle that especially naked brutality like 30 days I could probably handle it if it was uh, another kind of start but not naked brutality um, let's see so we're looking for this Ban. I think it's this man's pretty good, but uh, let's see. Let's look for a good start. And I'm not looking. I'm not finding anything really good here. So let's see. Let's go down a little bit ways. Maybe here. So here is okay. This. I think this band is all right. Right. This band around this band. Okay. 40 50 days okay so here there's a lot of good places right to make contact with other people uh, so 30 days a little too much 40 days is more oh, how come there's 40 days here wow 40 days not not bad if it's 40 days over here okay so but it's colder oh it's colder over here so temperatures will matter because your crops can die if you f pick a warmer spot uh, your crops may not die even even through the winter chances are they will though and then their cold snaps and then everything will die so let's let's look at this so I think over here is pretty good somewhere around here is not bad so 40 to 60 days, 100 so granite limestone, sandstone, 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 limestone, limestone. Okay, that was uh, that was marble, granite, and slate. 30 days though. Uh, so you can generally see what I'm looking for. Uh, 40 to 50 days, around 1500 uh, rainfall, 
uh, primarily stone stone type uh, marble and then granite granite because granite is the strongest uh, stone type so I'm just gonna go uh, find a place uh, and uh, you don't have to and then pause this uh, this uh, recording uh, alright so let me look for a place okay I think I want to settle on this one spot here to say uh, large hills with marble and granite and it's only 30 days of growing so it's gonna be a little bit tougher uh, yeah temperature wise minus 1 to 27 it's not super ideal rainfall is also not as much as I would like but it's about as good as I can find I, I haven't found anything so this particular map was kind of rough so but we'll go with it we'll go with it so next thing we're gonna go and uh, find a character so your first character is, is going to have to take care of himself right so this guy these traits are actually okay psychopath isn't even an issue but he's addicted to psychite so guaranteed <laughs> guaranteed he's going to uh, have a mental breakdown and you can't have a mental breakdown when you're starting in, with this game so uh, but otherwise this guy looks pretty awesome you know uh, okay so so the first three things I look for in a guy is construction cooking and plants so construction he doesn't pass muster so uh but cooking plants he's he he looks really good so he this guy i'll just put him down at the bottom i he's kind of really borderline like nah he, he he wouldn't pass just because of the psychic ad addiction so if you're addicted at, at, at some point you're going to go into withdrawal and then when you go into withdrawal your unhappiness is so high that you're going to have a mental breakdown at some point and when you have a mental breakdown and you're alone a rabbit or a rat can kill you like the Madden rabbit event might might happen and then you're one you become a sad wanderer or something like that you're wandering around and and then the rabbit comes over and kills you and it's game over so you can't do that so that kind of chemical fascination that's that's a no-no uh, so I already say careful shooter too smart that's pot pot pass too smart is bad because the mental breakdown threshold so construction cooking plants that guy does not pass muster no. ambrosia addiction no no bad nervous body pur body purist never accept bad body purist for your first character it's just okay in this game people lose body parts all the time and for you to be a body purist just it makes no sense right so but nervous is bad body purist that's two bad traits but he can construct he can cook and he can plant and he has no health issues so I'm gonna put him down here for backup so I'm gonna go and look for another guy and if this is boring for you I would skip ahead just uh, I'm just gonna do this for the rest of the uh, video and then uh, it'll be uh, the second video that we can start playing uh, uh, or yeah okay fast learn optimus T to learn okay no bad trades right T to learn is not a bad trade it's not a, it's not terrible it's not, it, I think it's actually kind of a good trade and uh, that means you it, the only thing is you can't take something like go juice and boost yourself with uh, if uh, you need need it for the combat. But this guy's pretty good. He can construct and he can cook. Plants not so much. No health issues and 20 years old. Really good. Okay, so let's let's look at this guy. Chemical interest I already already know. Uh, chemical interest is basically a guarantee to be to get addiction like painful fascination is 
he's gonna get addicted like right away when as soon as some drugs show up he's gonna get addicted the chemical interest eventually he's gonna get addicted and then you're gonna have to deal with that it's just too much I don't want to do that cyclically hypersensitive that's a bad trait nudist uh, nudist is actually a bad trait because you end up getting a penalty when you're wearing clothes and you need to wear clothes so you don't even get construction okay construction cooking plants okay cooking is bad underground or brawler so torso stab okay so this is a somewhat significant scar so he might actually suffers pain from this and uh, if that if so it's pretty much permanent unless he can get a healer mech serum which is really hard to come by and uh, because you can't repair it you, there's no <laughs> no medical procedure you can do to repair it. you can't replace the torso so uh, that sab scar is there to stay but undergrounder is good and brawler is um, I would say it's not bad it's it's pretty it's good it's it's not huge uh, but what it means is he can't carry a gun if he carries a gun he's not gonna be happy so he's got two out of the three bad torso and he's a brawl which is kind of a borderline so he's kind of borderline good okay so he's kind of borderline good like and he can't cook though so this is going to be an issue if your first character can't cook he's gonna get food poisoning a lot and that's gonna be an issue so dumb labor not capable of dumb labor that means you can't haul and you can't clean and that you cannot have your first character not being able to do dumb labor I, I percent uh, that's a bad trait but industrious and jogger jogger is super good like uh, but no this unfortunately dumb labor just kills it I, even incapable of violent I can even put up with but and then he and then it's 85 is uh, that stab scar definitely is painful so six stabs okay so uh, that torso scar bad so no nimble psychopath oh a psychic addict forget it uh, games this is a little bit much uh, yeah no construction Nick neck again neck you can't replace your neck that's another you can replace your leg so the middle toe scratch thing can can be dealt with but wow that's so it's pain you're getting pain from that that's bad okay so brawler pessimist teetoler uh, and construction is okay cooking and plants actually this guy is okay f except for the pessimist and the next stab now nah, I'm just gonna go random somebody else can't not capable of violence so if I get a character is not capable of violence I can do that I can live with that you know you can just build traps and have you know a raid somebody who's raiding you just uh, get hit by the trap or some wild animal get hit by the trap that's fine but these better be good the, the stats better be good this guy no this guy's 53 also so he's getting old violent intellect so aesthetic that's good psychically dull that's good it's construction no cooking though so again this guy's too not not good enough to be incapable of violence you know and I'm like in like I can definitely you know ignore but come on violence this better be super good right this is this is kind of decent but like S this co this combo needs to be better for me it's too old cataracts slothful jogger uh, okay construction cooking oh, okay forget it okay violent he, trans okay ugly ugly is a pretty bad trait y you might not think that's a bad trait but, but it's minus 20 opinion for everybody else and so everybody hates your guts the staggering ugly is minus 40 so that that's super 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 bad you don't want staggering ugly just no ugly if you know super good stat and then the other good 
traits are good. Now this is fine, but ugly and incapable of violence. And look at that plant score. No, not oh, addict, addict, addict. Okay, fascination. No, iron wound, jealous. Okay, construction, cooking, and plants. This is okay. No, not good. I mean, it would be okay. If you have better stats or better traits, but jealous is not a good trait. Iron Wild is really good, but uh, Bloodlust is bad. Four times as likely to start a fight, but construction, cooking, and plants. This is actually a decent character. Uh, she's a little old, but okay, we'll, we'll, we'll say good. Construction, cooking, plants. So this was the other one. Okay. We'll say that's the pot passable one. Okay. Toad. Uh, kind, nimble. Oh, body pierced. No, I don't know. No, you cannot have your first character incapable of caring. That's just. You're dead. This. Okay, frail. Oh my god, 76. No. Okay, caring. No. You cannot. Your first character absolutely cannot be. So cooking zero, that's a little much. No. Uh, underground quick sleeper, that's those are good traits. Construction, okay, I can load that. Cooking zero, no. Abrasive, okay. Uh, Hypersensitive, bad. Misandrous, bad. Bad, bad. Okay, lazy, abrasive, underground. Okay. Okay, I'm look look at these. Okay, no. Construction, cooking. Okay, plants kind of weak. Trigger happy. Psychically sensitive. That's a bad trait, but not terrible. Terrible. You can kind of deal with it. Uh, so construction, cooking, but not plants. Uh, somewhere down the bottom. Okay, Nicholas. Chemical fascination. I'm just not gonna deal with that. Chemical fascination. No. Super immune, psychically dull. Both of these are good traits, but incapable of violence. Okay, you need to be able to construct, cook, and do plants. No, that's not having tough. Too smart's bad, but tough is good. Uh, construction. No. Construction, no, and you got all these scars. And this one even gives pain. Yeah, no. Uh, no. Undergrounder, depressive, and chemical interest. Okay, no. Slowpoke, creepy breathing. Slowpoke is pretty bad. Uh, first character. Sanguine, cannibal, abrasive, and you can't even be violent. Artistic. Hypersensitive, super immune. Okay, so hypersensitive is bad. And these two plus hypersensitive, just tough and super immune are really good though. Like trigger happy, teetotaler. You can't. You can't have somebody who can't care for himself. Night Owl, transhumanist. Okay, these two are pretty good. Ugly is gonna hurt. 11% pain. Oh, 12% total pain. Plus, you can't. Okay, no, never mind. Misogynist, quick sleeper. Okay, no. Night Owl, iron will. That's good. Construction is passable. Cooking. Okay, this guy is passable because. Look at these traits, Iron Wild and Night Owl. Uh, Night Owl just, um... Night Owl's almost neutral, it's pretty much neutral, so, let's see. Blood Lust Newbow, I think. Okay. Fisher, Undergrounder, Brawler. Uh, construction... Cooking. Okay, this, this one. Starship Janitor. Chemical interest. No, I don't want to deal with that. Mm, this old torso spine. Okay, this is too much. Too much uh, crap. Vol plus volatile plus none of that. Construction, cooking, plants. Construction, cooking, plants. Ugh. Undergrounder and kind. No health issues. This is possible. Was Nobu a good one? Nobu was construction, cooking, plants. Okay, Nobu was a good one. So, undergrounder and kind. So this this is the last one. So we can go go through. Bloodless is bad. 
construction, cooking, plants. This is kind of okay. Kind of okay. No, no, no. It's just not good enough. Underground careful shooter. Okay. Conf uh, heart blockage. Oh, man. Nervous kind knew this. Okay, construction cooking plants. No. Fast learner, pretty. Construction cook. Okay. Construction cooking. Okay. Brawler, ugly. Smoke leaf, addicted. Construction cooking plants. Transhumanist. Uh, nervous. Uh, no. Not good enough. Neurotic. Whoa. Look at all those health issues. These are good though. Um, no construction. Cooking and plants. Oh, 65. No. Nervous, depressive. No. Underground, too smart. Gorman. Gorman for the first character. Kind of rough. Uh, blood. Okay, two bad traits. Chemical interest. Construction, cooking. No. Iron will trigger happy quick sleep. All good. Construction, cooking, plants. Wow. Wow. I think I just hit jackpot here. I think this is the best. Off the top of my head, no problems. Cooking, plants, construction. Wow. Wow, this is good. Look at that. Trigger happy isn't fine. You know, it doesn't matter. Uh, it's not. I, I would call it neutral. Like it. Like you're better with a careful aim. But Iron Wild and Quick Sleeper, that's. Those are really good. And so no health issue. I think this is it. This is the winner. This is the winner right here. So so we're gonna start with this guy character. Alright, uh Alright, I think that's it for the first video. And then the next part we're gonna go into base building. Okay, so thank you for watching. See you next time.